Oh well, nothing for it but to carry on. Let's keep moving to Tannendorf, Schellendorf, Sellendorf. Let's go north to Sellendorf. Some tracks there, I'm not going to follow them. Until we get paid to kill stuff, there's not much point in the early game. Especially if you're still injured. Are we still injured? Yeah. Oh, this guy's fine now. Okay. But we're still incredibly light and squishy. Tannin Weiler is southeast. That's the way we've come from. There's no contracts to be had down there, so I don't want to go south. I want to keep coming north. Let's go to Weslam. Weilersheim. Weilersheim. 12 brigands, many thugs and a few poachers. That I think we can do without anyone dying. Let's take them on. Now there are 12 of them, so I am going to have to play strategic defensively. Wait until they come closer. Step up on the hill. Oh, my archer started an annoying little crevice. Yeah, come up on the hill. We're going to try and take the hill. Okay, so we want this guy up on here. You can be back here. You can move up to here, which means you can move here and I can move here. Wait. Yes, yeah, so you're going to move here. No. Shit, I moved to the wrong place. Yeah, I need to move here. And shield wall. Yeah, you need to move. Not there. There. You need to move here. 50%. Nice hit. Double hit for the kill. Beautiful shots. They're returning fire, men. Watch your ground. Okay, what else we got? Slinger for 36%. 43%. 47%. 51%. I think the guy with no armor and the cleaver is the most... Oh, beautiful. Best option than this guy headshot? No. 53%, 61 percent on this guy. I just need to kill uh this guy probably. Yeah, we need to take the axe guy down. Well, we injured him at least. That's a good start. Okay, so we've got a sheer wall shield shield wall along here. Yeah, you need to come here. The Axeman's got an injured hand now, so that's 25% less skill. That's really useful. Let's uh, finish him off. 45. Oh, we hit the archer. The slinger. Good dodging. You can wait. Double stab. You can wait. You can step down and stab, I reckon. And then this guy can come across. Yeah. Actually, there's no need to risk it. This guy might die, but 
to this guy, but whatever. Don't spear wall. I want him to step in. Good. Now you can spear wall to keep him away. Yep, good. Well, I'm glad I waited with him. You can spear wall now. Good kill. Very good. Right. Um, you can wait. Who is the biggest threat? This guy's quite a big threat. And he's also got low armor. And you can kill him in one because he's got no helmet. Like that. Beautiful. That takes care of that. Now you've just got the archers to worry about. Two archers to worry about. They're dropping like flies, lads. Keep it up. Another stab. Stab for the finish. Double stabbies. And the pike finish, unfortunately, didn't finish. They don't know what to do. They're just terrified. They're just shitting their pants and holding their ground. Like, oh, oh what do we do? What do we do? Are you going to die? That's right. You're all going to die. Stabby. 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 You can now come to down here and stabby as well. Very good. Whoops. Who did I just finish? Oh, that guy. Okay. Yeah, good. Charge to the archers who are going to run away now. Oh, my God. They're still fighting. They are some brave friggin' archers. They are standing by this guy. This guy must be their lover or something. That's the only explanation. They're like, friggin' thug, we love you. We'll never abandon you. Can the archers get a couple more kills here? Ah, oh, shame. Shame, shame, shame. Lock this guy down. Go for this one. Finish him. Beautiful. And can you steal this one? No, shame. What about you? Have you got a line? No, you might hit this guy. I don't want to risk it. It's not worth it. Unless this guy gets beaten to death, but I doubt that will happen. We did that entire fight without taking a hit up until that guy got hit by the, the club. We did have an amazing position, though, on this hill. Amazing position. Which is really lucky. Sometimes Battle Brothers, you get that. Sometimes you get the map terrain is in favor of the enemy. Sometimes it's in favor of you. And you just have to hope you get the best terrain possible. Which we did this instance. Very nice. Very nice load of stuff to sell. Nothing particularly valuable, but still stuff to sell for free. What's that? That's a 50 as well. So one of you guys gets a 50. Probably you. No, I care more about the archer. Meat sack gets attack, defense, and health. He's only got 42 health. That's appalling. Steel brow. Light tank gets defense, initiative, and health. Steel brow as well. Heavy tank gets defense, fatigue, and health. Steel brow as well. Light meat gets Defense, initiative, and health. And get steel brow. Thrower two gets attack, fatigue, and initiative. And uh, what do we give the throwers? I think the throwers get Colossus to help keep them alive. British Knights Executioner, Steel Brow, Colossus. Yeah, I like, I like Steel Brow and Colossus on a lot of my men because it just gives them extra survivability, which is really useful. That extra occasional arrow that hits them, some it won't kill them basically. Turns a kill into just an injury, and then you got a chance to retreat.
Hunting season, you say. To Hans the Wise in Wessenfels, about a day to the west. Well, since we don't have any other work going on right now, and we haven't been there before, I think we should go. 188 is pretty tempting. I can't afford anything like that right now, though. Oh, 50 for venison, though. Definitely. And it's cheap food anyway, so let's buy it. Seven more days. Since we're going to the north... We're going to need provisions. We're going to sell the venison when we get to a city. We'll, we'll take this contract. Come over here. Sell the venison at Wessenfels. And... Yeah. See if there's any work for us. We've got plenty of supplies now that we've crossed that place. That was hunting season. That town that was hunting season filled our provisions up. It's getting towards night. We're traveling near the forest. So I'm going to... Slow it down so I can see stuff like that and go round them. Because that was probably brigands. Excellent. Crown's well deserved. They've got ambush trade routes, so hopefully the venison will sell for a pretty penny. It does. 108. Look at that 50 crown profit on the next town over. Let's sell all this other stuff we don't need as well. Everyone's got a shield, don't they? Yeah. Keep hold of that for any newbies we get. We're going to need a new one there. 908 isn't bad. Two skull contracts. Delivery contracts. Grafenschat. About a day to the southeast. Grafenschat is all the way down there. Let's not do that. Let's carry on in the north. Shame. Damn shame. But I don't, I'm not, I don't want to go south again until... Some Thralls and a Reaver. Six of them. That we can do. No worries. Yeah, some Thralls and a Reaver. Let's get them before someone else does. Yeah, you better run, you barbarian scum. They're going to charge towards us. Where's the Reaver? Down here. We need to archer the, down their front line. Oh, terrible misses. Terrible, terrible misses. We need to archer down their front line and shield wall up for the throwing. Come on, guys. You can do better than that. You should be able to do better than that. I expect more from my archers. Crude javelin. Ow, to the chest. Right, let's try that again. I want the reaver down, to be honest, but this guy's got the highest chance. Of dying. Can shield wall up and wait. Finish him, please. Thank you. Now we want the Reaver to go down. Yeah, good. Good hit. We want to move to here and spear wall with him. Go after the Reaver. Just to wear him out even more. Very nice. Move to here and spear wall. Move to here and spear wall. Spear wall again. Uh, spear wall again. 
step forward and oh you can't stab oh I, that i used i did the wrong person i meant him to stay there and this guy to step forward and stab so instead this guy's gonna step to here and no he's gonna step to here and spear wall here i messed that up that was annoying Don't die. I'd hate to lose someone on a pointless little fight like this. On a meaningless skirmish like this. It would be so irritating to lose someone. Wait for the adjacency bonus. Fuck me, that did a lot of damage. Finish him, please. Thank you. You can step forward and stab at the th the um, thrall. Step there and go for the attack. Come on, guys. Fucking seriously. I don't want him to be able to throw. So, step here and cover him. Oh, he did throw. I'm losing a lot more than I would. Thank you for finally killing that guy. Taking a lot more damage than I anticipated we would. I didn't think we'd take any damage, but these guys are giving it to us. Wait for the adjacency bonus. Adjacency bonus. You can stay there. Wait for the adjacency. Wait for the adjacency. Step forward and stab him for the finish. Good. Step forward and stab. Everyone stab. Stabby, stab, stab. Yeah, he took a lot more damage than anticipated we would. Thank you very much crude throwing javelins and an axe we a crude axe we can repair necklace it's hoping we'd get some of those throw oh then he had crude throwing weapons didn't they okay so that's going to take a lot to repair but it'll be worth a lot when we do you need to come off until your hat's repaired you're fine you just need more armor you can come off for the meantime. You can go in there. We've got a couple of bear hats which are worth 50. So cultist tank, get one of them. Cult meat, get... Oh, that's a 50 as well. Um, meat sack. Meat man, awesome. Gets defense, attack, and health, and nine lives. Good work, meat man. Sniper gets attack, fatigue, initiative. And I think we give him gifted. Oh no, we give him Colossus as well, right? Sniper, Colossus, yeah. Just to increase his foot survivability. 62 hit points now rather than 50. That's much better. Cultist tank. Attack. Defense. And health. Rotation. Definitely rotation for you.
21 tools and supplies. Let's go to Thalberg, where we'll hopefully pick up more tools and supplies. Oh, six barbarians. Some thralls and a reaver again. Well, let's follow them. They're not going to attack us, I don't think. I don't want to fight them in the woods. By the time we chase them down, we might be much better suited for attacking them. Let's see. You've just lost a little bit of health. You are missing initiative and a little bit of health. You are missing quite a lot of armor. But there's not very many of them. I reckon we can do this. Like that. It's 10 versus 6. I, do I want to fight them in the woods? Yeah, I think we do. Yeah. Come on, good map. Okay, interesting. Reaver's fucking dangerous. Take out the javelin guy, please. Come down to here. This is really unfortunate. They're all on a path. We're going to have to spear wall here. They're all on a path, and I'm in the bloody woodlands. Which means I can't move very quickly, but they can. See this? I can't get through to here. Six of them. One, two, three, four, five. And there's one in there. So one's going to come up around the top. I reckon you're going to have to stay there and fight the one around the top with this top guy. Spear will where you are because you're half dead. You can wait. Yeah, shit. Fuckers got cover behind a fucking tree and they're throwing shit at us. Damn it, this sucks. Oh, we're going to lose. Oh, we're going to lose. Oh, that really sucks. He rotated his mate in. All right. Step forward and see if we can bump him back. Nope, that failed. Fuck, this is all going wrong. This is going horribly fucking wrong. Uh, I don't know what to do about this. We got an awful position, like a terrible map position. They got on the road and just came and attacked us. And they've got a wall here to protect them from archer fire. What a load of bullshit. You have to go around. You guys have to start going around. You need to go here. Come out of the way so the archer can step there. Shield wall up, but you're about to die. And even if we come down here, they've then got a fucking choke point here as well. Come to here. I don't want to lose my main tank. He'll die. Raymond will die if he goes there. He didn't have enough armor. So just hold off. We need to kill this guy somehow. Spear wall. There's no point to... Oh, fuck's sake. Yeah. Fucking annoying. The terrain on this game just completely fucked us. I just have to go all out and hope for the best. But we're losing... The terrain completely fucked us on this. That's really annoying. A group of six is going to take us out because of fucking terrain advantage. We just got a good fight with terrain and now we've got a bad fight with terrain. Now we can't fucking hit anything either.
Don't have rotate, so fuck it. Who has rotate? We just gave someone rotate. Was it the tank that we've taken off? This is just bullshit. I'm so frustrated with this. It was going so fucking well. Hit it in the noggin. There's the kill. Would you fucking hit something? Why have you only got 39% chance to hit? Good, the Reaver's down at least. But if someone's going to survive, you may as well survive. They don't have any more throwing weapons. But if I do that, he'll step to here and he'll step through and my archers will be um, compromised. So I have to stay there. And just die. Yep, there he goes. Fucking kill this idiot, please. Thank you. And this one as well. Fucking missed every single shield attack as well. 77% misses. Fuck you, game. Fuck you. Finally, some fucking hits. Thank the Lord. Can't believe we lost two people to this fight. We should have lost no one. Just the fucking terrain absolutely wrecked us. We lost the light tank. Fuck. We got some throwing axes for it, though. Fucking light tank went and died. That sucks. Uh, that's annoying, but c'est la vie. Difficult fight in the woodland. They were able to advance really quickly and I couldn't get into position very well because I was off. I was off in the woodland and they were on the path. And then they had a fucking barrier of trees they could hide behind and a choke point protecting their flank. So no matter what I did, I just have to straight out fight it out with them. And fighting a two-handed reaver, just, no, just, you're going to die. And that's what happened. Fuck, I can't believe you lost the light tank. That sucks. Okay, well, what have we got? Light meat, heavy tank, meats. You and you get the two next heaviest helmets. Oh, no, wait. Meat sack doesn't. Meat sack's not... I don't care about meat sack. There we go. Oh, and the cultist to survive. And then these guys get the bear hats. Actually, I don't care about you as much as I care about him, the thrower. Fucking irritating. I'm so pissed off about that. And then we couldn't hit anything either. All of our attacks missed for like two rounds. 
just to make it that little bit more that little bit worse just to make the rng that little bit more irritating cult me gets attack whoops gets attack defense and health and steel brow thrower gets attack fatigue and initiative You get some throwing axes at least. Yep, sniper can start with some throwing axes and then switch to his short to switch to his uh, hunting bow. Known cheater. Oh, this guy's got a level as well. Oh, I haven't given him his perk. That's why. Uh, what perk do they get? Colossus. Yeah, Colossus to help them stay alive. Why have you not got a helmet? Light meat. Wear the gimp helmet. We seriously need tools and supplies. 32 tools. That was an annoying fight. We should have um, waited until they come out into the plains and then attacked them on the plains instead of in the forest. But should have done this, should have done that. Hindsight's a beautiful thing, isn't it? We just lost a light tank, didn't we? So we've got... Cultist, cultist, meat sack, heavy tank, cultist, meat sack. Yeah, let's hire another farmhand. How much was this guy? 410 for a farmhand. Are you kidding? Piss off. You can get them for 140 usually. Okay, so we're not doing that. How much are tools here? 245 isn't bad. We'll buy two stacks of tools because we need them. And since, since we need money, we have to sell here. Simple as. Even if the price isn't that good. Now it's worth 250. It's just not worth it. How many days of. We've got three days of crowns. We've got enough provisions to last us. I'm not going to sell here as much as I think we need the money. Because we're making such a loss on it. Let's head over to Vardestead instead. That place um, isn't hostile to us, they're neutral. The relations here are just cold, and it's a capital city. It's a fortress town, so their prices will be reflected on the relations, on the basis of relations. And my relations with them are not good. Hopefully they've got ambush trade routes here, and we can make a pretty penny. They don't. That's a bit better, 277. Yeah, much better. What's the contract? Deliver cargo in Gerheim. About a day to the northeast. Gerheim. Yeah, that's the way we're going. Do we want to sell our stuff now? Probably not. We'll keep hold of it. We've got enough inventory space. We don't need to sell anything if we've got enough crown to last us for a few days. Enough coin to last us for a few days. And we've got work here as well. Can't believe we lost our light tank. That fucking sucked. We can't get into combat for a while either yet because we're still healing up. So we need to be careful. Take it nice and slow. Trading caravan just came through the woods, so we should be safe. To speed through that bit. Can't see anything around here. It's now dawn. We're right near a watchtower, so we can speed up a bit again.
Oh dear, what's this? Beast prints. On the road. It's two unholds. We don't want to tangle with two unholds, but they're coming towards us. So we're going to have to tangle with two unholds. Unless we can loop them. Yeah, let's loop them. We can't we can't fight two furry unholds at this point. They are being fucking annoying. Do you have any work for us? Hunt down what terrorizes for 640. We're going to be running along the road anyway to try and find a caravan to get rid of the unholds. So let's run away and run down to the tracks and see if we can find something to fight these unholds for us. Like this caravan or whatever's just come across, just come down. Here we go. Supply caravan with nine. Killing a couple of unholds at this point would be very useful. So we're gonna we're gonna stun them and fall back and then stun them again and then fall back and then stun them again. We're gonna keep them stunned on the road essentially while this caravan catches up. And then we're gonna use the caravan to kill them. There we go. And try and snipe the shots. Firstly to get the unholds off the bloody off the bloody map. And secondly to try and get the kills. And I'm not taking any chances. I don't want any deaths for this. We're not being paid for it. We're literally just trying to get them off the map and aim for aiming for their fur and fangs. So yeah, I'm taking a big step back because it's going to take these guys a while to whittle them down and kill them anyway. So a nice big step back to make sure the AI advances and I'm not in any danger. And then we're just going to take, we're going to wait until they're low on low health and then take pot shots at them. Because I don't, I don't want to step here either and shoot behind them because when you do that, these idiots rotate you in. So just a couple of steps back for them. Right, now we can move forward with the archers and be in a better position for killing. Don't want to be on that high ground. No, if I move there, he'll rotate and push me in, so. I don't like being here because he might rotate me in again, but and then the other guy will rotate me in, but I think it should be okay. He's not in a threat, so he won't rotate he won't rotate himself out. See how much damage they do? It's crazy. Instantly killed that guy. Fuck me, we need to open fire. Uh, we might not be able to do this after all. Whoops, hit the guy in the back. Sorry about that, mate. We won't be able to kill him like that, so we're just going to hold fire. Come on, guys. You need to hit him. 
You need to hit him down so I can get the finishing strike. Oh, okay, you killed him, good. You also need to kill him so that you don't die is the other thing. Ooh, finally. Oh, I should have put him on the back and this guy up here. At least he's within range of firing, of throwing. Oops, I didn't mean to finish with him. I meant to wait. Whatever. Shit, this is not good. Well, all his armor's gone, at least. He's got full health. He's got... They. He's just absolutely just destroyed those guards. One guard holding down the line now. How many throwing axes do you have? One. You might as well chuck it and then get your bow out. Good throw, my friend. Good throw. Shield wall, my friend. You need a shield wall. You're the only thing standing between us and certain doom. He's still confident. He still thinks he can win. I don't like the fact that confidence giving him is giving him a boost to everything. We need to start getting ready to get into combat with it. I don't want to step near these guys because they'll rotate me in. We're going to hold fire again. But we're just going to come across and get ready to be at least in battle. To be ready to jump into battle with it in case it comes near our archers. It's healing faster than we can kill it because we're fatigued. It's getting more health back. It's getting health back more than we're killing it. Basically. This is going to be down to the wire, guys. You've got to hit it. Oh, fuck. If you guys don't hit it, we're not going to be able to hit it. Oh, good. He's coming back. Yeah, if you guys don't hit it, we're not going to be able to kill it. Good. Dazed him. Ah, oh, no more arrows. No more arrows. Okay, you can get off the high ground then. You can just retreat. We can't. You literally can't do anything anymore. Get onto the high ground. No, because he might rotate you into the fight. You can get up on the high ground because you're our strongest guy. They should kill it now. Missed. Didn't get an attack. Double miss. It's going to get its health back. Eric is what? Light meat. Yeah, he can go there. Oh, he can't go there anyway. Uh, you can wait. Your what? Your meat sack. Yeah, you can definitely go there. And spear wall up. You can wait. 
You can come up over here. You can spear wall up. You guys need to fucking start hitting, otherwise we're going to be in real trouble. It's still confident. It came to within an inch of its life and now it's bloody healing. We have to kill this thing. Good, he stepped forward. Good, it's no longer confident. Surround it, guys, and stab it down. Oh, they're going to get the kill. For fuck's sake, that's so annoying. We almost got the kill. We didn't get anything for that, but they've wiped off the map. That's the most important thing. Most important part. They're wiped off the map. We're going to go find what's terrorizing. We're going to stop off in Ogna while we're here. Shame we didn't get that kill. We almost got that last hit in. That spear stab almost got it. 320 is pretty good for furs, actually, but I can't afford them. How much is selling here? 259. That's not bad. I suggest we sell all the trash we don't need. Sell off a bunch of these spears and clubs. Some of these butter knives. Crude javelins. The axe. A couple of these. We got 700 suddenly. We can sell the sirs at a premium for 450, so you're making 150 crowns on them each. That's not great. Yeah, if they. Yeah, it's not quite what I'm looking for. I don't have enough crowns for it either. Okay, let's head back to Gerheim, find out what's terrorizing it, and bring it back onto the road and then fight it.